Hello friends! In this video you'll see how have the actors of the movie The Lost Boys changed. You'll know their real names and age. I will show you how they looked then in 1987 and what's with them now in 2022. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go! Michael, Jason Patrick, is Lucy's native son and also Sam's older brother. He's a rather handsome guy with shoulder-length curly hair who, thanks to fitness classes, is in good physical shape. Michael is level-headed, able to show concern and knows how to clearly assess his abilities and doesn't seek to prove something to anyone. Knows how to drive a motorcycle, but is not a supporter of extreme driving. Dwayne is not the last in the Davis gang. He is laconic, not an active interlocutor, but he is also characterized by fidelity and he doesn't leave his people in trouble, knows how to have fun with others and always takes part in dangerous games of the gang. Dwayne has a beautiful attractive appearance and has a dark and deep look, played by Billy Weir. Alan Frog, Jameson Newlander, is Edgar's brother, he loves horror comics and is generally good at comics, but not enough at it compared to Sam. Alan is aware of vampires, knows how to destroy them or restore the human nature of half vampires and is always ready to help when it comes to this. He has a lean build and often wears what appears to be an army dog tag around his neck. Max is one of the residents of the beach town of Santa Carla and owns a local video store. He looks like an average person who is unremarkable, however he leads a double life and is actually the city's main vampire. Max is distinguished by purposefulness and is not used to deviating from his plans. Played by Ed Herman, who died in 2014 of brain cancer. Edgar Frog is related to Alan. Along with his brother, he runs a family business, a comic book store, but their main goal in life is to search for and destroy representatives of the vampire race, which they came to after an obsession with comics. He has shoulder-length hair and likes to go around with a bandage on his forehead. In particular, he often wears red or military colors. Played by Corey Feldman. Sam is one of Lucy's sons. He believes that he dresses very stylishly, although some don't share his opinion. One of his favorite activities is watching TV, especially the MTV channel, and he also loves to read comics and understands them very well. Sam can show courage at the right time and doesn't get lost in a difficult situation. He was played by Corey Heim, who died of pneumonia in 2010. Lucy, after the divorce, alone began to raise her sons Michael and Sam. She's a caring and loving mother who also knows when to be tough and not give up. Lucy is interested in the lives of her children and it's important for her to maintain a good relationship with them. She wears short haircuts and also wears hoop earrings. Prefers to put on watches on the right hand. The role is played by Diane Wist. Paul is part of the vampire gang led by David. He is a rather sociable nature, likes to smile smugly and generally has a cheerful outlook on things. Emotions can take over him, which is why he doesn't always think sensibly. Played by Brooke McCarter, who died of a genetic liver disease AAT deficiency in 2015. Marco is a vampire who is one of David's henchmen and gets along with him pretty well. He has a somewhat insidious nature, likes to smirk and has a sadistic inclination. Marco has large eyes and curly blonde hair that is short in front but below shoulder length in the back. He dresses in a rather bright and unusual jacket and prefers to wear fingerless gloves. Knows how to ride a bike, played by Alex Winter. Grandpa is the birth father of Lucy and his kinship to Sam and Michael. Sometimes he can behave somewhat strangely, likes to set his own rules, striving to ensure that everyone who lives with him under the same roof adheres to them. He is often conceived with a bandage on his head 
and he also liked to walk around the house in a bathrobe, played by Bernard Hughes, who died in 2006 of natural causes. Maria lives in Santa Carla, where the Emerson family moved to live. She works for Max at his video store, where she holds the position of a sales clerk. Maria is a rather sociable and friendly girl who knows how to be really grateful and sometimes likes to be a little frank. She has a slender build, curly hair and a sweet smile, wears bracelets on her right hand. The role is played by Kelly Jo Minter. Letty is the youngest member of the Davids gang and is on good terms with Star, with whom he has a kind of brother-sister relationship. He is a rather sweet boy with pleasant features, who has a vampire essence but tries to fight this side of him, although sometimes this doesn't always work out. Lady often feels lonely and loves to be noticed. He was played by Chance Michael Corbett. Beach concert star Timmy Capello played a concert with his band in Santa Carla, which Michael and his little brother came to see. He has a good voice that the audience likes and also knows how to play music perfectly with the help of a saxophone, which he often demonstrates at concerts. He likes to perform in some pants with a naked torso and can also often complement his image with chains jewelry. Surf Nancy is one of the members of the Santa Carla surfing gang. He often, along with his friends, is engaged in thefts and takes part in brawls. It's characterized by a manifestation of determination and unwillingness to share the beach with beginners. He has dark hair with shaved sides and prefers to keep it short. The role is played by Todd Feather. Star is the only girl who was part of the Davids gang where she acted as a kind of decoy and couldn't properly manifest her will. She's a half vampire, but managed to maintain her human qualities and was kind to Letty and often protected him. Star has cute features, beautiful fluffy curly hair and a quiet disposition. She was played by Jamie Gertz. David is the leader of the local vampire gang and also reports to Max. He is a rather ruthless vampire who has a strong gift for persuasion and tends to deceive in order to achieve his desired goal. For him, people don't represent any value and he treats them mainly as food. David is not one of those who likes to show his emotions. He knows how to drive a motorcycle. The role is played by Kiefer Sutherland. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course, subscribe to the channel.